Hello, this is Dr. Oz. In this video, I would like to show you how to create clustered and stacked bar charts. So you can see one year data for uh, company Kirkland, and you can see for North region and South region. And let's create a stacked column chart. So what I need to do is first, I need to start highlighting my data from A2 till C14. And then click on insert. And then here you will see under charts, uh, column or bar chart. And then on the column or bar chart, you could choose 2D or 3D uh, charts. And let's go with 2D chart. So let's start with um, stack column chart. Click on this. Again, you can play with the desi design of this. Let's see, this design. Mm, I don't like this one. This is not too bad, but white again, there's no contrast here, so I don't like it. Love it. Um, it's okay. All right, so I like this one, to be honest. Uh, probably the best. But uh, let's improve the data in ratio here a little bit by adding some axis titles. Check this. And uh, Y axis here is sales and hundreds of dollars. And my X axis here is months. So since months are pretty obvious, you can just eliminate this to gain some space, uh, which will improve your data ink ratio. And let's keep the legend because we have two data sets. And let's label our chart title, which is Kirk Land. Numbers on charts like this, delete click one of those labels and delete. And let's eliminate the grid line to improve our uh, data ink ratio, delete. Okay, so this looks pretty good to me. And now what I would like to do is, this is a stack chart, let's try um, a cluster chart, Control C, click in an empty cell, Control V. So let's change the chart type here. by under chart design you can see you can change the chart chart type let's click on that and here i would like to use um, cluster column instead of stacked click ok so now you can see easier each individual region here totals are more obvious here you can see better those each individual regions if you want to, you could filter uh, the region that you don't want to see. Okay, so these kind of charts again are important to to uh, analyze and visualize the categorical data like this. I have two different categories and different months, so this is beautiful. That's it for this video. Until next video, enjoy business analytics.